Let's go! Hello, my name is Space Typo. Today I am going to be reviewing the Quo All About Eyes kit. This is from their 2019 holiday collection and I'm going to be creating this look. Um, I created a more kind of daily, everyday look as well as something exploring um, as many colors as possible because there are 52 shades in this palette. There are also um, five glitter eyeliners and five eyeliner pencils. I'm gonna do some swatches, not some swatches, I'm doing all of the swatches. So yeah, keep watching, I guess. Okay, so this is the palette um, it's called All About Eyes. There's shit on the back. Um, yeah. So I got this for Christmas. I did use it a little bit because I didn't think that maybe I could do a, a makeup review. Um, I just didn't consider it, just didn't think about it. And so I, it is used a little bit, like this was completely white before. Um, but yeah, anyways, I don't really like palettes, like eyeshadow palettes that don't have names. I don't know, I just find it really fun to have names. And this one obviously doesn't. And so I think that we're gonna name some today together. Okay, so my dumbass completely forgot to uh, film this uh, thing, this part, so I'm just gonna do my best and um, yeah, I'm just gonna go as quick as possible, so in terms of swatches, so this is Twilight, New Moon, Eclipse, Breaking Dawn, obviously named after the Twilight franchise, then we're gonna go dark rose black, which is my- oh, that didn't swatch well. Which is my coffee order. Seneca's beard, after Seneca from the hunk- holy fuck. Seneca's beard. It's not supposed to be sparkly, I just have sparkles on my thing. On my fingers. Um, or it's supposed to be slightly sparkly, I can't tell. Anyways, Seneca's beard from the Hunger Games. Rum Tum Tugger. Then we're going Keeper, which is supposed to be Keep Your Stupid to Your Self. Because I like to say that sometimes. River Monsters, which is my one of my favorite shows. Puffle Puffle, which is my Hogwarts house. And then Spidey, named after Spider-Man. He's my favorite superhero. Zero, which is supposed to be after Coke Zero. Light, spelled L-I-T-E, because it's after uh, like those light video games. Like there's the paid version, there's light version. Apology video. Like, subscribe. <laughs> Raid Shadow Legends. <laughs> YouTube. Then, oh, that was not well swatched. Send nudes, and then Daddy Camus, because Camus is my favorite uh, philosopher. Until Dawn, Set the Vibe, which I'll explain why I called that later. Yeet Machine is what I call my bong. Lighthouse, Man. City, Ender Dragon, Enderman Eyes, Nether, oh that did not swatch as well as I wanted to, Nether, Portal, so obviously that is the Minecraft dedicated row, um, BVB which stands for Black Veil Brides, oh that's actually kind of nice, Troll, if you know you know, Pearl was named after one of my gerbils. Let me swatch that again. Um, rest in peace, Pearl. She actually died on New Year's, which is like a really good preview as how 2020 is gonna fucking go. Hockey puck, ice skate, screeny, which is my abbreviation for screenshot because you know we say movie, I said screeny. Natural burial, I am an advocate for natural burials. Hobbs, after Calvin and Hobbs. Then we have Bojack, which is my favorite show. Bojack Horseman. River Monster. Oh, Monst Monster. Um, obviously not sponsored, but I love Monster. Stick that there. Ginger. 
After my other gerbil, she makes a cameo. She died in April. Average finger guns, cause I noticed I was watching my videos um, and I was like, oh, I actually do a lot of finger guns at the, at the beginning. Yeehaw, cause I just love the cowboy aesthetic. Work bitch. It shows up better on the eyes with concealer. It doesn't show up as well on my arm. Centromondo. This is means center of the earth. It is a inside joke and you'll understand it later. Jackalope because that's my icon. Oh, that is such a pretty shade. Jackalope is such a pretty shade. Highlights. Named after my highlights series. Peace, which is also after the fact that I do peace signs at the end of my videos. So these are all of the swatches. Um, the metallics swatched wonderfully. Some of the, um, you can see some of the, uh, not the non-metallics swatched kind of poorly, especially like these kind of lighter colors here. Um, it was mostly kind of the like grayish colors. The brown swatched quite nicely, especially up here. Um, but yeah, so basically, these names are all, oops, these names are all just my, like, inside jokes and very personalized. And then, actually, we're going to go on to, uh, so then there are these liners that come with it, so I'm going to just swatch it on the side of my hand. So this is this, like, dark goldish color. This one's really pretty. This is the cold also quite nice um so i'm filming this part in july i have used these a couple times i really enjoy this green actually these are all really nicely pigmented which i can definitely appreciate these ones don't have fancy names those are just unnamed and there's this pink there's this kind of purpley brown. I don't really know what color this is, but it's an interesting color. There's this silver, a brown, a bluish color. This blue is nice. A purple. This one I actually had tried during the video. I did try to put it on, but it like barely showed up. I don't know if it's because I had a million. I had a shitload of eyeshadow on or not, but yeah, it, the purple was really not working for me um, during the video. And uh, then there's that black. So here are the, so there's these, so there's these stick ones and then there's these glitter liners and then here are all of the shades. Yay. Okay, so that's a huge swatch. Oh, and then there's the brush. The brush is pointy and I hate it. Okay, now it's time for me to make a makeup look. Oh my god, I just, I, I didn't fucking record. I'm mad. But anyways, um, I was, I went, I did keeper in the crease and then it went keep your stupid to yourself. That looks cool as fuck. I've never done this kind of thing before. I'm not liking this brush, by the way. Um, I mean, it works, but it's just... I'm gonna go into Work Bitch, which is the only is the song that got me through universe at first, through um, all my exams. During exam season, I just listened to Work Bitch by Britney Spears over and over again. And it gets me through the school. I mean, I can't tell if that looks good or not, not gonna lie. I, j I literally cannot tell with these kinds of things. I'm just. I'm not an artist, uh, so I'm just doing my best here. I'm gonna go into Twilight. I fucking love Twilight, like... That is very pigmented and 
this brush is it's okay it's just it's difficult to do details with it so I'm actually gonna switch to my normal brushes which I don't think is which I mean it's a it's a coincidence um, because again this was a gift I didn't you know ask like I want a quote palette but all of my brushes are quo just because uh, my brand is drugstore that looks okay um, back into ender dragon we've gone into full sparkle mode apparently oh Jesus okay we're going we're going going God <laughs> let's do a little bit of eclipse oh that's a good color that's really nice I like that one I don't know if that was a good move though um, I think that was a little bit of poor decision-making on my part oh fuck that looks really muddy doesn't it let's just put some more concealer on and hope for the best I have a really bad habit of using way too many colors because I just get really excited. <laughs> I'm gonna use a bit of Set the Vibe after Christopher Odd, who's my favorite YouTube channel, has been for many years. Whoa, I like that color. It's too powerful. Uh, one thing I'm gonna say is just to remember to set the vibe. What that means is headphones on, lights off, Volume up. Here we go. I don't know if that makes any difference, to be honest. I named some things by Rose. And row is Lighthouse Man City, which refers to the Bioshock franchise, which is there's always a, there's always a lighthouse, there's always a, a man, and there's always a city. I love that franchise so much. It's so interesting from a philosophical perspective. I would recommend Christopher Odd's Let's Play. I watch that one a lot. Um, I've seen it a couple times, which I don't know if it's a good thing or a bad thing, but um, I really, really, really enjoy it. Peace. Because I like to end my videos just like peace because I don't really know what else to do. Rum Tum Tugger, the best cat in Cats. Um, I actually haven't seen the 2019 version yet. I'm fucking obsessed with Seneca Crane's beard. Ever since I saw it, I was like, on, on the Hunger Games for the first time, back when it was released, I was like, I want Seneca's beard. Dark Roast Black is my coffee order at Timmy's. And so, in conclusion, that was my last shade, and, uh, peace. This is my baby. Her name is Ginger. She's so fucking cute. <laughs> and I named a shade after you, Ginger. Look at her. She's so cute. She said hello. Say hi to the viewer. Hello. <laughs> hey. I love her. I love her. She's so cute. She's so cute. She's so cute.
Look at her. He's such a fuzzy little girl. <laughs> okay, okay. I know you want to go back home. 